Hello, hey ho, how you doing? <laughs> hey, listen, I got the hat on. We love my hat. Flash hat, eh? <laughs> I thought today I'd talk like a Maori because I'm getting bored. Jeez, I'm getting bored. And I just realised why. All my blogs, all my, my posts I've been doing, uh, I didn't tick the box, allow the comments. And I need comments. I need you fellas to comment, you know. If I sling off at the Maoris, I want you fellas to go crook at me, hey, and growl at me. Because that's what I want to, I want to communicate with you. And the only way I can communicate with you is to talk your language, you know. Now, you know I've, I've I come from uh, um, Bay of Plenty, don't you, in the Waikato. I was born in the Waikato. I'm a Waikato Maori Pākehā. Uh, and and I was brought up in uh, King Country and, and uh, Bay of Plenty, in Rotorua and Tipuki and all that, around that area, Wakatani, all that area. But the, part, the area of New Zealand, I've been around most of the places, eh? But I haven't been to Poverty Bay. Poverty Bay in Gisborne. I nearly went there when I first left school. When I first left school, I wanted to be a shepherd on a sheep station, and I applied for a job at a place called Tolliga Bay, which is in, in, in Poverty Bay, you see. And, and I was to go down there, and they were going to meet me, and I was going to work on this big sheep station, you see. Uh, but something happened. I uh, had an accident. I shot my brother accidentally. You know, we're having rifle practice outside the house, and a little bugger run around from behind me and in, into the line of fire and I shot him through the head and killed the poor bugger, little, little bugger, you know? And, and, and I was upset and, I, and they sent me away and, and, oh God, I was a hell of a mess, eh? I had a mental breakdown later in life and all that stuff. You know, I don't, I know you don't want to hear it, you've heard it all before, but uh, things change. Sometimes you think you're going to do something and a whole thing like that will change your life, won't it, eh? Yeah, I just had a look on the Google, a Google Tolliga Bay, and I see it's a popular holiday spot, and its pop population is predominantly Maori. Okay, now it talks a lot about there in Maori. I don't understand Maori language, eh? I've never learnt it. At school, we only learnt the, the swear words. We didn't learn, learn the proper Maori language, you know. And and a lot of the Maoris. They're worried about losing their language. They're worried about, they're trying to bring the, teach people how to speak Maori because they think they'll lose the language. One of the problems with you fellas, <laughs> and me as a half of cars Maori, is you keep sleeping with Pākehās. Now, as, as long as Maoris keep sleeping with Pākehās, they don't have to worry about the bloody Maori language. They're going to have to, they'll lose the race. The whole race will die out if they continue to sleep with Pākehās. If Māori continue to speak with Pākehās, they're going to get less and less Māori in them, aren't they? Eh? Some people say today, well, there's no full-blooded Māoris left. And that's only in 150 years. Imagine what's going to happen in another 150 years. People will have all sorts of breeds in them, eh? And, and this, this racism thing will ha has to stop. It's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to have to end because there'll be no such thing as racism because people will have a bit of everything in them. <laughs> it's only now that they're starting to latch on to it. But anyway, that's another grizzle. And I want you to write and tell me, what do you think? Look, put a note on my, when you're listening to this, when you finish, put a note on. If you don't agree, let me know. If you do agree, let me know too, okay? Talk to me. I want you to talk to me. Sitting here talking away to myself, I want I want someone to answer me, you know what I'm saying? So I think we should change the name of Poverty Bay anyway. I don't like the word poverty. Poverty is negative. And Captain Cook called it po uh, Poverty Bay because when he went there, there was no tucker. He couldn't find any food or or water, or fresh water, or stuff like that, and he, and he called it, so he called it Poverty Bay. But things have changed, it's not Poverty Bay anymore, it's prosperous. They've got wine factory, wineries, and everything there now, and it's growing, okay? But it has to change its name, it's got a negative name, 
Poverty Bay, what a stupid name, okay? So they should change it to the opposite. Change it to Prosperity Bay. Prosperity. That's what they need to change it to. Because you see what happens to the brain goes in here. Whatever you put in here, you act you act accordingly. If you talk about poverty, you'll become poverty. You'll look you pardon me, you'll have no money. And you'll be poor. If you talk about poverty all the time, you got to talk about prosperity. You got to program your brain to think prosperous thoughts, not thoughts of poverty. Understand what I'm saying here? I might be half class married, but I know what I'm talking about, eh? <laughs> oh, yes, I'll do I've been around 73 years. I know what I'm talking about. I learned about the mind. I learned about the power of the mind. I know how. How vital it is that you've got to put the right information in. So come on, you fellas, talk to me. <laughs> talk to me, growl at me, come on. Have an argument. Let's have a big powwow about this. Let's get down to the nitty gritty. Do you think we should change it to Poverty Bay? From Poverty Bay to Prosperous Bay? I reckon we should. What do you reckon? <laughs> I listen to you, Marys. I love you. I love your guitar playing. I love your singing. I love the hula hoops. I love all those good things about you, Mary fellas. You know how to drink beer. <laughs> You've got a good sense of humor. But by Jesus, some of you half-cast parking ones, you got to watch you. You get carried away, okay? So I'm going to growl from time to time. I'm going to growl at you. And I want you to growl at me. <laughs> Because that's what life is all about. We've got to debate these things. I'm not always right, you know. Sometimes I get it wrong. But I want you to convince me that it's wrong. But I think we should change the name to Prosperity Bay. What do you reckon? You can do it, no trouble at all. Just tell everybody at school it's now called uh, P Prosperity Bay. Just change it overnight. Put it in the paper. The, they've got a newspaper there. What they call it? Something about the Herald, isn't it? Isn't the Gisborne Herald or something? <laughs> Hope it's a better bloody paper than the Timaru Herald. But anyway, they might put a notice in the paper about me. They might want me a, a photo of me and, and say, well, this fella down in Timaru wants to change our name from Poverty Bay to Prosperity Bay. <laughs> That'd be good, eh? And get everybody talking about it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Have a yarn to that Herald newspaper and see if they want my photo. I'll send one down. Or they can come up and take a photo of me. <laughs> okay, see you later. Bye-bye.